Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Thanks for joining me. To my returning subscribers, thank you so much. I know this video is a lot different from my other one, so I appreciate your sticking with me as I learn this. Uh, to any new people watching, I hope that you click on subscribe before you go. I'd love to see you come back again, and I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. And here I am showing you my new Erin Condren planner cover. Just love this cover. This was one. It's an interchangeable cover. This one you could actually pick your own colors in this. So it's a Christmassy one that came in Christmas colors, but I chose to do it a little different with a black background, some white flowers, and silver details. So I'm just loving that. So this is one of the pages that I was working on last week as well. As you can see, that's my motivational page that I hope keeps me motivated. That's me at my highest weight that I know about. I was 190. I didn't step on the scale too much after that. And where I am now and just some motivational stickers to kind of keep me going. And on this page, I already had uh, Lady Penelope on top, the Brittany, and then a picture of my husband and me on our wedding day. And then one of the last pictures that we had taken together a few years ago that was actually at a bike shop that we were there for an event. And so I added these two pictures in, um, and again, I'm using this for memory keeping. So this is a picture of my husband and I and our daughters, Raina and Sabrina. And then up on top, I've got all the puppies that we've had, and we have had some great puppies through the Britneys that we had. And then we uh, had Sir Stetson, our first one, and then we had him bred, and we got Lady Penelope. And then um, after we got into the American Brittany Rescue, we did do some fostering with them. And then we actually adopted Jakers. We went out to Maryland to get him. And then somehow we got into the Dane Rescue. So we've got uh, Mr. Wiggles down on the bottom. He was a whopping 240 pounds. And then in the middle, and the pictures aren't that great, but it was Baby Eve and Big Earl. So here we're just going to start to get ready for our November 4th through November 10th. And the kit that I'm using, I'm showing, is the Stickadella kit. And it's a fall harvest. And again, I just love these fall colors. Um, trying to use up the, uh, the fall ones before we get into the winter ones. And just loving uh, looking for new stickers and getting new sticker ideas to get them. I've also picked out some pictures that I want to use for the week for um, my memory keeping. So that one right there that I'm showing is our daughter, Raina, and our husband, Jeremy. They actually went on a Mediterranean cruise. And there's our daughter, Sabrina, her husband, Mike, and the jelly beans. And this is actually a picture from a few years ago from River City Saloon. It's my husband sitting in his wheelchair next to his uh, bike with the sidecar. The owner actually let us park in the back where it was no parking only just so that we could have easy access to be able to get him in and out of his wheelchair and into um, her restaurant. So that was always nice going to Anoka. Here I've, I bought some uh, new whiteout, which I'm still having trouble with. Uh, the one I had before was like three years old and it worked better than the new one. But the uh, date cover stickers for the days of the week just don't seem to cover that whole thing at the bottom. So, and I like using these date stickers of the week and I've already put in the days of the week, like four, five, six, whatever. And it just kind of sets off the mood for the color and the theme of the book. And I'm thinking, I don't know, maybe next week I should maybe go up and start over where that blue washi strip is, that blue stripe is with the divider, or if I should leave it where it is. So if you've got any thoughts on that, let me know. But again, that is just a nice start to the week on that and getting that done. So that's always one of the first things that I do to make it nice and easy and makes me feel like I'm getting somewhere. Because looking at that blank page always seems to uh, scare me a little bit. So now I'm going to put the washi that came down with the kit. And I'm going to use the uh, smaller washi right down at the bottom. And again, that's a nice fall themed with some nice fall colored leaves. And then on top, um, I'm going to use the, on the second page of the week, I'm going to use that full washi strip on top. And then when I flip the book over to do the uh, first page, I still want to have that November showing up because I didn't buy any stickers that I like that have the days of the month on them. I did buy some, but they just actually were, I really should have read it better because they are too small. They really don't even show up. And um, on the side here, that's usually where I put my sticker that I put down my elliptical steps and um, 
the mileage and the hours that I put in the forecast for the week. This, this week I decided to use those uh, little chart markers um, just to use them, just to try to keep it maybe a little bit more cohesive and without having the stickers and it was like a, and I just thought maybe that would make it look a little bit better. So we'll see how that works. Of course, if I could lay it down straight, it would save me a heck of a lot of time. Um, and again, I'm going to use that space off there to put in the forecast for the week. And then at the end of the week, I'll go back and put in all my steps and hours and mileage. Down at the bottom of that, I'm going to use my little seriously sticker, my grr with the little weight scale, where I'll put in my weight on Monday morning and then again my weight on Sunday morning. And so we'll see how that goes. Um, usually I, I did make some stickers for this and then I made some a little bit smaller that I just uh, printed out on paper, uh, my color printer. And I just kind of wanted to make it a little bit smaller. And I think I still want to try to make it a little bit smaller just so that it fits maybe in that same uh, spread. So going down, it would have that same length. But I'm going to have to try to skew that a little bit to try to get that to be the right length. So those are the pictures that I want to put in this week for my memory keeping. And I haven't put them down yet. I just kind of put them where I think I want them placed. And I'm putting in the uh, full boxes from the Fall Harvest from Stickadelic uh, Weekly Kit. I'm just putting them in where I think I want them to go. And, of course, they're going to have to stay there because I am pressing them down. So I'm putting them in um, so I can work around the pitches for the week and just kind of give it some nice color, kind of keeping it fun. And now I'm forgetting what I'm doing next. Oh, so then... I wasn't going to do this under the days of the week last week. I used these uh, little charting stickers too from the kit. And then I thought, well, I wanted to leave more space open for some more motivational type things. I knew I didn't have a lot going on this week. So at first I decided just to put them on a few days of the week that I knew I had things coming up. Uh, like on Monday, I knew I had something. Wednesday, everybody's favorite day, trash day. Woohoo, right? But it was also recycled, so I noted. I know I wanted to make sure I got my trash out this week because I had a full recycle bin from different boxes. It's just full of cardboard. And that comes every couple of weeks, and sometimes I miss it, so it builds up faster on me since I like to do a lot of online ordering, even just for staples for food and groceries. It just Plus, you can get them through Ebates going that way, so you get a little bit more money back than if you just go to the store to pick up your water or your toilet paper, things like that. So if you can get it online and get a little bit of cash back and free delivery and the price is the same, you just got to do it. But it does give you more stuff to throw out at the end with the uh, packaging supplies. And again, I'm just still putting down those scheduling plans. And as you can see, I'm going to go back to the first page in a few minutes to uh, put them on where I wasn't going to put them. And I, like on Monday, I knew we had uh, the Isogenics. I buy that uh, protein shakes for the morning, my morning shake. And every now and then they come out with some limited ones. And they would be coming out on Monday the 4th in the, a mocha flavor. So I was dying to try that. And sometimes they sell out fast. So I wanted to make sure I put that in my planner to remember to go online and order it. I did order two of the jars. So I'm happy about that. Uh, Tuesday after I thought about it, because I knew I've got an automated order coming in from ItWorks. And from ItWorks, I wanted to make sure that I got another thing of my keto coffee packets. I don't seem to like it hot like most people like it, but I like to throw it in my morning shake with my protein. And it just kind of keeps me focused and alert for the full day. And just celery, I needed some more just celery powder. And that's what I mix every morning in an 8-ounce glass of water. And that's how I start my day. Wednesday, of course, I used my trash stickers, recycle, and my I had a little target run to do on the way home. And the stickers that I used in that box on Wednesday were all from Planner Kate. Thursday, I knew I, um, I've got a Scentsy Club order and my whip box that's going to be coming soon. So I just wanted to go in and double check what I had on my order. So I wrote that down on Thursdays to remind myself to do that. Um, Friday, I knew I wanted to work on um, doing the 
uploading of the Plan With Me week for Halloween week. I already had it um, videoed or recorded, but I hadn't done the voiceover yet. I hadn't uploaded it yet, so I wanted to make sure I got that done Friday to get it up before the weekend. And then also on Friday, they surprised us with a work barbecue. So we had the best chicken. It was stuffed with chicken breast. It was stuffed with bacon and cheese and it had a, a nice seasoning and just put, when you cook on the grill, everything just takes better. So they had that with some marinated steak and some salads. And so that was awesome. Saturday, I knew I wanted to go into work for a little bit, but I knew I had a fashion box uh, that was coming in. So I wrote down to uh, get that fashion video done. And Saturday night, I knew I wanted to work on YouTube, try to get that uploaded, and then work on YouTube on responding and watching videos. Um, Sunday, I wanted to go online um, to get another Walmart order in. Like I said, toothpaste and toilet paper, just everyday staples, some flavored water, things like that, that I don't have to go to the store to get and get money from Ebates. I wanted to check some different sites because I needed to find a new ugly Christmas dress. So I had that scheduled and I'm happy to say that I did find one and I am just dying to get that in. Can't wait. And uh, to take in the Halloween decorations from outside before it got too cold because pretty soon it's going to be time to get, um, get them out there. So here I am deciding that to put down those pictures and that's a, uh, one at the bottom, it's all of us down. Uh, we had gone, I went home uh, in June for Tory Pie's first dance recital. So we ended up afterwards at the Providence Place Mall. We went to Dave and Buster's. So there's Tory Pie and Sabrina and Jeff, um, Jeff and then Aiden. There's me, Raina, Jeremy, Mike, and Maddie Matt. Um, I also laid down the pictures that I wanted in the place of Sabrina and her family and Raina and Jeremy. And I'm starting to fill in those tasks that I already mentioned. Um, just trying to think what else we're, we've got going on. But um, I've got my Friday sticker and from uh, Planner Kate. I've got the Planner Girl on Friday. Um, from Sugary Gal Pop or Sugary Pop Gal. I'll have her link below. I think she is just so cute. Um, and I know I've got a lot of empty spaces this week, so I'm looking forward to using a lot of the deco stickers and some motivational tips. And here, um, I think I got ahead of myself, So, but I'm just uh, filling in the uh, things that I just talked about for the schedule that I wanted to make sure of things that I got done this week. And again, I just love using these kits. They just make the memory planning and scheduling. It just makes it so much fun and just adding in some personal pitches here and there too. Um, I, I just hoping that, you know, and I, I went back a few days this week and just looked at the other pitches that I'd already done and the, the layouts. And I think that's doing what I wanted to do. I want some something nice and happy and fresh when I look at it just to keep myself motivated that I'm also I'm not doing it just for me um, I want to stay healthy for my family and want to stay healthy for my grandchildren um, so that I, I get to see them and they can get to see me and and of course doing videos here and there on YouTube so they can get to see the changes so when because I know the last time I saw my mother, um, I hadn't seen her in a few months. And it was when she had come out, it was like, oh my God, that's my mother. So I don't want them to think that about me um, as I get older and changes are going to start coming more rapidly. So I just really want to take care of myself. So here I've got this bread open. I've gone through right there. You can see I've already put in the forecast for the week so I know how I want to dress. And I think the highest uh, temperature of the week was supposed to be around 43. And maybe the lowest was around 13 degrees. So I knew pulling for the week, it was going to be sweaters. It was going to be cardigans that I could layer and uh, some warm clothes. So here I'm just putting down some more stickers that came from that Stickadelic kit. Just love that big sticker right there with the uh, lady sitting on the couch with her hot cocoa. Or maybe she's got um, some kind of Baileys in her coffee with her planner supplies and socks just being comfortable. 
I put a little half box on Friday so that I could use my Friday sticker and the plan with me sticker just so it kind of looked um, a little bit more full and then later you'll see I'll add some more deco from the kit that I'm using from Stickadelic and uh, love that picture on Wednesday of Raina and Jeremy they had taken a Mediterranean cruise and that was one of the pictures they took just a nice, nice memory. And of course, with Sabrina and Mike in the car with the jelly beans, giving me a nice selfie. I used the uh, weekend banner there from the kit to signify the weekend. And again, just some more deco from that kit. So there's a nice lady carrying a pumpkin. And then later, I'm going to put down a puppy. Maybe he's uh, a Labradoodle with a scarf on. And one of the ladies at work, Jam, she has got the cutest puppy, uh, Big Lou, we call him. His name is Lou. He's a Labradoodle, and he is so, so sweet. She's taken him to work. Don't tell everybody when my bosses were out of town. And uh, he is just so good. He just slept under her desk most, most of the day. She could talk on the phone without him barking, and the UPS man could come and go, the post lady. And he just stayed there, just so well-behaved. Just really nice puppy breed. So I think I'm getting ready here to maybe put in some final touches. So I'll probably shut the video off in a second. Um, well, for the, for the week anyway. So I put in some motivational stickers. I had shut it off. The end of the week had come. So I filled in all the steps on the elliptical. Um, I just looked at the temperatures where it was. I thought about maybe changing them to maybe write in a different color what they actually were, but I just decided to leave it at the end. I've got some motivational stickers. Be true to you are. Follow your dreams. Celebrate the little things because sometimes those are the best things in life. I wrote down about the lunch that we had at the Providence Place Mall. Um, and again, just my elliptical steps. I've got my weight that I put in from the Monday. And then again on Sunday, it stayed the same, so I was happy about that. So I hope that everyone enjoyed this video. I hope that you give it a thumbs up, and I would love to have you come back and visit again. So please like, subscribe, and comment, and we will chat again soon, everyone.